What's up, guys? Thanks for tuning in. We're doing our first YouTube live premiere of a show. Usually we're on Twitch at this time every week, as well as Tuesdays at 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. I'm here from Washington State, like Western Washington, with my dad, who uh, you've probably seen in the Twitch chat as Dutes Marimba. And uh, this is my first time visiting this new spot, which is pretty cool. We've got a lot of percussion happening. And uh, this is the first uh, first duo thing we've done in over a year because of COVID. And uh, it's pretty exciting. So hope you enjoy. And um, if you'd like to support, check the link in the description. There will be a uh, Bandcamp link to both of our Bandcamp pages and our project that we've done duo together. It's on Bandcamp, right? The duo. Yeah. Yeah. So free, free if you'd like to support us, please go s check out the link in the uh, video description, which will take you to the Bandcamp page. And, uh, you know, if you don't mind, give a subscribe and a like here on YouTube. It really helps a lot. And, um, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll proceed with our schedule. <laughs> so uh, what is this one? It's called Entry of the Pods, right? Oh, well, we were going to do variety of elements. Oh, sorry. I have it all. No, let's do variety. <laughs> we're going to start with variety of elements. elements. From our first CD. First, wow, okay. That was a while ago. It was like five or six years ago at this, at this point. Uh, 2013. It's more than six. Dang. Eight years ago? <laughs> the first duo. That's crazy. I'm all right. telling you, man. <laughs> going back. <laughs> I was going to ask for a tuning note, but it doesn't matter. Oh, no. We don't hear. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Is that All good? Right. Yeah, that's good. Variety of elements. A one, two, three, one. Mm-hmm. 
elements. Yeah. Okay. Nice. It says, yeah, it says J dudes, B dudes. I don't remember right. I think you I wrote think this you one. Helped. I think you helped. I'm, I, maybe I wrote some changes or I something. Can't I don't remember. know. <laughs> I think that's a while ago, right? Yeah, this is eight years ago. I can't believe it. I'm telling you, that's the first duo record. This is the first one. Our first duo called Orange Jeep. Yeah, um, Orange Jeep. All right, we're going to continue now. Let me re-mic the thing. Is it damaged? Yeah. Oh, yeah we're going to continue with a song called Dandy's Descending, and I've actually never played this before. Yeah, this was two years old. We did it with me and Fumo. Yeah. Okay, so originally for for um, my dad and trumpet player John Fumo. Right. This is called Dandy's Descending, and this I played clarinet on, too, I think. Right, okay. right. Yeah, it says bass clarinet, so I'll play clarinet and then I'll come back. I'm playing the bass part. Yeah, let me just adjust <laughs> the camera. <laughs> Hit the bass line. I can make this an intro. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> All right, we got Dandies Descending. Yeah. Top. Can open. you give me? Can you give me an A? Yeah, that'd be. Alright, kill it. Kill it. I think you start, don't you? Mm -hmm.
Dandies, all right. Yes. Dandies descending. You want to do an Irish thing now? Yes, that would be good. Cool. We're going to play. Um, you could probably just share a mic for this one, right? Or actually, let's do just this. Just do that, right? And then cool. I'll sit on the bench. Yeah, we're going to play now. Anything you pick, I'll follow you. We're going to play a traditional song. <clears throat> I guess they would call it like a reel, right? Or something like that? Reels are 6 8 and jigs. Uh, 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 reels are, are four four and jigs oh, are so six eight. Oh, so this is a jig. So nice. the jigs are six eight, yeah, and then reels will be four four. Whatever you go for, I'll follow very you. Cool. So this is yeah. So this is going to be a very famous and um, popular Irish jig. I'll do a little bit lower. Called uh, the Irish Washerwoman. Classic. <laughs> Some classic Irish jig action. <laughs> Irish washerwoman. On alto flute, which is easy. Yeah, that's hard. Is that instrument, I still haven't figured out how to if maximize the efficiency of the breath to the sound. Really? Because it takes so much air, so you lose a lot of air and lose a lot of tone, so I just have to, you know, it's one of those like specialty flute player instruments that you have to just really get good at. The economics of air to sound ratio is hard. But is it long? Yeah. It's a long thing. Right? But it's it's really it's a great instrument for sure. Excellent. Yeah. Is it bonk we're gonna try? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we just get one the uh, so the next song is a song that we wrote together to be performed at the Sunlin Sun Space, uh, which was a great venue in a Shadow or Sun Valley, Shadow Hills, Sunlin Sunlin Sun Space in, in California, which is where I grew up. And uh, Shout out to Noel Rhodes and Sunspace. You guys are awesome, and all the stuff you're creating, even now online, is really great. And uh, yeah, this is called Bonk Sting, dedicated to Sunspace. Cool. <laughs>
Kliplinger Waltz. It might be a speaker, or that's Klipsch or something. Interesting. I think I got. You don't even know where you got the title. I can't remember this. <laughs> this again. It's a while back. Yeah. Not quite sure where I did that title. For Clip, bass saxophone, Clip which Linger. we don't have, but you know, you yeah, can, I mean, you can fake it. So <laughs> you can say bass saxophones were huge in the twenties. You know, they used them, and this saxophone, uh, cur uh, very courteously, let me let it. Uh, my uncle Cameron Dutz, uh, my dad's brother here, let us borrow this for the stream so I wouldn't have to travel with all my other instruments. So uh, this instrument was from the 20s, and bass saxophone was big in the 20s. So, so they're uh, related. Yeah, they're related, and it probably played with a lot of bass saxophonists in its day. You know? Yeah, the history, man. <laughs> it's so silver. <laughs> yeah. Right? Right. It's silver lacquered, like Tom, with a brass bell. Nice. Two bars? Mm -hmm. Okay. So one, two, 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 three. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
fun uh, song. Reminds me a lot of Popeye the Sailor Man. <laughs> um, classic. Classic, man. Classic. <laughs> okay. And this is called Sailor's Hornpipe. Yeah. You want to just... You want to start it slow and then speed up? Yeah, sure, sure. <laughs> I'll follow you. Sailor's Hornpipe. Those are kind of tiring. It's a lot oh, of... Whew. Man, you've got a, a lot of <laughs> notes, isn't it? Yeah, it's a lot of notes. But it's cool. Good songs. Classic songs. Sure, man. Now we're going to return. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The saddest <clears throat> All right. Dedicated to... Uh, <laughs> this is for a spinal tap, right? Yeah, yeah. Dedicated so, to Christopher Gale, who made his greatest joke about Dean yeah. Martin being the saddest. Yeah, this was always... 
I'm always huge, huge fan of Spinal Tap. You know, we we always watch Christopher Guest waiting for Guffman, Spinal Tap Best in Show, yeah, all that stuff. Um, and uh, the quote from from I forget is Nigel, I think is his name. I think so. The, yeah. In 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 Spinal Tap, he's playing the guitar. You know, the amp to eleven or whatever, and he's like, D minor is always the saddest key, <laughs> and like he's really and so this song is called Is It the Saddest Key? <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> and it's in D minor. Yeah, well, kind of. But. It is, right? right? Kind of, yeah. Because I, I, yeah, yeah, kind of, yeah. So I'll start this bass either. Yeah, yeah. Saddest key. Kind of the saddest key. You know, he's on to something. <laughs> yeah, yeah, 
D minor is the saddest key. It could be. Yeah. You might be right. The swing, good fling. Yes. So earlier you heard a song called Bonk Sting. And now we're going to play the uh, sibling sister song to that called Bliff Bling. So we have the sequel to Bonk Sting, Bliff Bling. Thank you. A little rhyming situation. <laughs> I hope I can play it. Because I think that's a good place yeah, to end it. Yeah, because it sort of works. Yeah. That's <laughs> Blip Bling, sequel to Bonk Sting. Yeah, and rhyming. <laughs> and rhyming the, the Bonk Sting. Um, you want to do another one of these things? I think I'm, I'm into or should Irish, we? But, but whatever, whatever, whatever. Yeah, let's do, let's do like the happiest one so that when we go into pensive, it's like a shock. Yeah, because yeah, it's dark. <laughs> I'm happy with like um, just any one you pick there. Maybe you should do an intro and then. Ooh, this one looks fun. We did sailors, now we do fishes. Well, this would be four already, so why don't we do Any one of them do cool. the six ones? Are they just classic, you know? Let's do the characters. They're all famous. 
We're gonna do the carry dance. This one's really famous. Okay. Wait, let me sit there again. Let me just. Okay. Make, make sure this is. Uh, I'll add this a little bit. All right. Oh, that's six eight. Okay. Ready. Yes. You just tell me how fast you want to do it. Well, if you do an intro. Okay. I can sneak in later. <laughs> And happy. <laughs> <laughs> That's a, a section of Southern uh, Ireland, Kerry. Uh, nice. The, the, the Kerry style and the Kerry hang. Very cool, very cool. Cool, all righty. Nice. Tempo. Yes. Oh, and then we could end with the entry of the pod. Yeah, we got, uh, we got this too, if you want to do it. Well, that, we can try that if you want to try that looks, on the It looks kind of hard. But we have a, yeah, we have a. <laughs> Oh, but pensive. That way you can just stay here in the kit for both of them. So let's do that. Let's do. All right, we're gonna do two more. Yeah, we're we're gonna do pensive situation and pods into entry of the pods. And uh, pensive situation we realized today fits perfectly on the range of the alto flute. So that'll be a lot of fun. (laughs) This is on our second record, I think. I think that's it. Second one, I think. Yeah, this. I don't think the third one. The second one. Three. Projects available on Bandcamp. Yeah, I yeah I have to review them because I really only remember the most recent one and the first. I don't remember the second one, I think. But, but there, there's a very limited c- actual CDs available. Oh yeah. From TonyandLabs.com. TonyandLabs.com. Check it out. Limited copies, physical copies available. Of the CD. You see, I'll put a link in the description also for that one. Okay. So I'll put the link to the to the Bandcamp albums. And, and Tony then the and Tony, Labs. Tony and Labs. That'll be good. Of isolation. I'll and to Twitch, yeah. I'll give you a picture of cool. it to post. All right, sounds good. Pensive situation. Right. Let me get more pensive. Get my Should I do an intro? Yeah, I'm gonna, I need to get in character for this one. Okay, let me do an intro. <laughs> Edit. <laughs> <laughs> no edit. Okay, here's, here's the beginning of pensive. I will now play the bass drum. Thank you. 
You gotta have the Darth Vader hat, you know. I think that trying. was very effective. If you're trying to be pensive, there's nothing like pensive than Darth Vader. So. <laughs> and they got a small animal there. This little Doberman. A little Doberman to be on that thing. That's great. I'm mute these <laughs> drums while we. Entry of the Pods, I think, is on the first. I think so too. This one's really old. The first duo record, and it's, it's hard too. It's 2014, see? That's yeah. like seven years ago. I mean, whoa. Available on Bandcamp. Available on Bandcamp. And the CDs are extinct, no, no longer in existence. Yes, there's only a few that remain, and they must be located in the world somewhere. Uh, but yeah, eBay, maybe. eBay. All right. Who might take us? Entry of the pods. Yeah, this, this one. one. Are we so, hard. Are we doing solos on this one? Oh, uh, I think it's a free section, don't you? Okay, cool. And then back to the. And then somehow we'll cue you cue the top, right? Yes. Where's the, where's the, DC? the DS is measure seven. Oh, right. See, I didn't have it. Where yeah, it, it's kind of weird, but we'll figure it out. Okay, DS. See, I, I'm so glad you told me. It's a full solo. Where's da, the da, da, da. Tell me the fine. The fine is measure twenty six, right before. It's 26. the DS. Yeah, okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. You have, you have that. Yeah, okay, so we got entry of the pods seven years ago. All right, seven year old song entry of the pods. Yeah. Sounds good. Mm-hmm. Thank you. 
Yeah, let's do it again. Half, re half rest or two beats? Yeah. <laughs> I know you know. <laughs> One, two, three, four.
<laughs> I love having a bass drum in the other room. You should put a target on it so that you can you have to like aim for the center with the sticks. The projectile bass drum. Yeah, and then you know what else I like is after the rebound, the clunk on the floor. Yeah, yeah. Well, you should put stuff on the floor too. Oh, yeah. So that when. <laughs> So you could have a ricochet. <laughs> you throw the stick at the bass drum onto another thing onto the floor. Yeah, you could do like a whole obstacle yeah, course. There could be a bunch of metal junk. <laughs> that would be a great. Okay, we got another plan for another twist. <laughs> All right, YouTube. Thank you so much for tuning in to this t premiere. This is our first YouTube premiere video. Uh, we will be back on Twitch next Friday with the Three Hunters for the first time in three weeks. So that's going to be really fun. And uh, a lot more to come in the future. And um, yeah, stay tuned for more stuff. Go to the links in the description. Check us out on Bandcamp. Follow on Twitch. Subscribe on YouTube if you liked what you heard. Thank you so much. Have a great Friday evening and a good weekend. And uh, we'll see you guys in the future. At the time that you'll be hearing this, we will have been in the chat room talking to you guys at the premiere. So future selves. Thank you for listening, and uh, friends, family, have a good one.